what's happening right now from RTV6, the Indy Channel. Now at 5.30, accused of starving her three-month-old baby to death. Tonight, an Indianapolis woman learns her punishment. It is new information just in from the courtroom. 31-year-old Bambi Glazebrook was originally charged with murder, but pleaded guilty to neglect of a dependent. Less than an hour ago, the judge handed down the sentence. Derek Thomas is live downtown with today's developments. Derek. Glaze Brook wept during most of the hearing. She said the worst thing was losing her child. The judge agreed. 31-year-old Bambi Glazebrook told the court that I know that my mind isn't right and I'm not able to take care of kids. That all became apparent when three-month-old Philip Roby was found malnourished inside her home. At the time of death, he weighed five pounds. Dr. Jennifer Waffle, the Riley Hospital physician who examined the child, said it was the worst case of starvation she had ever seen. At some point, um, Philip couldn't even respond. He probably couldn't even cry to express um, express his poor health because he didn't have the energy to do that. So it's very sad. Parenting is so much more about the emotional capacity to care more about your child than it is about yourself. So when you see someone who is worried much more about the next high, the next cigarette, than they are about their child starving to death in a drawer, that's troubling for us. The child did not have a crib. He was kept in the drawer of a home entertainment unit. The judge sentenced her to 30 years in prison. After 20 years, a judge would consider another placement. She must also serve 10 years probation and can have no unsupervised contact with children. Glazebrook has four children. Three have already been adopted. One is in foster care and her sister hopes to adopt that one. Live downtown, Derek Thomas, RTV6.